hello uh, this is something you don't want to miss um, I actually found something that was uh, painted 300 years before the Vitruvian man it almost seems like Leonardo da Vinci was inspired by this other word artwork made by Hildegard um, Hildegard of, of Bingen uh, made her painting in Liber Divirum Divinorum Operum okay and so we're going to take a look at that and um, what we're going to to notice is that so the Vitruvian man let's get back to that the Vitruvian man has the symbol of the squared circle what is the squared circle well the squared circle is the name of the philosopher's stone symbol it's the official name of the of the symbol of the philosopher's stone the Vitruvian man is a depiction of how the how how you take a man a human a man okay and and you you square it uh, uh, you want to transform it into something else you have a circle and you want to transform it into a square a square of the same area and this is something that uh, is very hard to do when it comes to this old old um, methods of using a square and a compass okay so this is the old in, in the old days they didn't have um, algebraic mathematics instead they used geometry and they used um, square and compass and so this problem of finding the square of the circle which is it's also a, a meta metaphorical of what's impossible um, people often say it's like squaring the circle as if something is impossible and uh, and this is exactly so it has become a metaphor for that right to take this into the divine uh, but so yeah there is a natural connection to the philosopher's stone that I talked about in many videos but so 300 years before this Hildegard von, von Bingen created the universal man uh, let's take a look at this so this is amazing it's absolutely amazing because it's exactly what I want to see and it's exactly what I want to show you it's exactly what I have been talking about it is the it is um, it is the cross section the cross section of a pearl again the pearl that I have been talking about for so long has layers inside of it you can also see these layers in an x-ray when you x-ray the brain you will see the the layers of, of this uh, of the brain sand that will be formed in the brain brain and it will be just like a pearl you know with the, the layers and so again we have it here again from one perspective the Vitruvian man is the symbol of the philosopher's stone from another perspective its original inspiration by Hildegard was a pearl and um, I'm very happy to see this. I'm very happy. Uh, it it proves my point and it helps you realize that this is true. 
that there is a truth, you know, and um, that's it. That's basically it. Uh, I just wanted to show you, I am uh, mind blown by this. I hope you are also, that it's, it's this clear, it's this much in your face. This is how it is. And um, um, you can even see it in the, in the names, right? You have Universal Man came first and then Vitruvian Man. Both are the same thing. Both are showing the Philosopher's Stone. In the first one, it's a pearl. The cross section of a pearl to make you easier to make it easier to see it. On the other one, it is the symbol, the squared circle. It can't be clearer like and than this. It it cannot be clearer. Uh, so, yeah, amazing, absolutely amazing. Have a good day. Bye bye.